Hello everyone, it's lovely to see you again and today's Friday. This is our fifth day of the school week. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Five days in the school week at most Scottish schools. Some go Saturday morning. But when I was at school, we just had five days and I liked that. Let's count in Scots. In, twa, three, four, five. And in Gaelic. Un, ga, three, kehe, coig, coig, that's five. I'm counting down. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. No days left. I remember being very excited going to school. I think some of you are too. I can remember my very first teacher. I loved her and she loved to sing. And we did a lot of singing at school. I'm going to sing you a song I heard in school. I didn't hear it at home, although we loved to sing there as well. And this is how it goes. Bobby Shafter's gone to sea, silver buckles on his knee. He'll come back and marry me, bonny Bobby Shafto. Bobby Shafto's bright and fair, combing back his yellow hair. He's my ain forever mare, bonny Bobby Shafto. And I pictured him. He must have had quite long hair, tied back like sailors sometimes did or do, and he had buckles, silver buckles on his knee. I don't think they were on his knee, but they were maybe at the side of his breeches that he wore. Silver buckles, that's quite smart, isn't it? I didn't ever see him, but I just pictured him. So here's the words. Bobby Shafto's gone to sea. Silver buckles on his knee. He'll come back and marry me. Bonnie Bobby Shafto. Let's sing that. Bob, Bobby Shafto's gone to sea. Silver buckles on his knee. He'll come back and marry me. Bonnie Bobby Shafto. Bobby Shafto's bright and fair, combing back his yellow hair. He's my ain forever mare, bonny Bobby Shafto. Let's sing it, and this time when we sing it, we'll clap. Bobby Shafto's gone to sea, silver buckles on his knee. He'll come back and marry me, bonny Bobby Shafto. Bobby Shafto's bright and fair, combing back his yellow hair. He's my ain forever mare, bonny Bobby Shafto. Give yourselves a little clap. When you clap like that, you keep time with the song. And that's what musicians do when they play music for the songs and the singer. Now, I remembered a lovely song we used to sing at home. And we had an aunt who specially liked this and she showed us the actions. And we used to sing it as well at the Sunday school party and the school party. Everybody sang it. And I'll show you the actions as well. It starts off and you get a little bit. It's called My Bonnie Lies Over the Ocean. So we had Bobby Shaft has gone to sea. And then we go, My Bonnie Lies Over the Ocean. My Bonnie Lies Over the Sea. My Bonnie Lies Over the Ocean. Oh, bring back my Bonnie to me. Bonnie means my person I love. For this one. My bonnie lies over the ocean, 
My bony lies over the sea. My bony lies over the ocean. Oh, bring back my bony to me. Let's try that together. My bony lies over the ocean. My bony lies over the sea. My bony lies over the ocean. Oh, bring back my bony to me. And the chorus after every verse goes, bring back, bring back, oh, bring back my bony to me, to me. Bring back, bring back, oh, bring back my bony to me. Try that with me. Bring back, bring back, Oh, bring back my pony to me, to me. Bring back, bring back. Oh, bring back my pony to me. It's very easy, isn't it? Well, it's so easy that we put some actions to it. So every time you come to the chorus, you go, bring back. Bring back, oh, like the letter O, oh, bring back my body to me, to me. Bring back, bring back, oh, bring back my body to me. Let's try it slowly first. Bring back, bring back, oh, bring back my body to me, to me. Bring back, bring back, oh, bring back my body to me. Let's try it at the right speed. I'll try not to go wrong. Bring back, bring back, oh, bring back my body to me, to me. Bring back, bring back, oh, bring back my body to me. Oh, blow ye winds over the ocean, oh, blow ye winds over the sea. Oh, blow ye winds over the ocean and bring back my body to me. Are you ready? And bring back, bring back, oh, bring back my body to me, to me. Bring back, bring back, oh, bring back my body to me. Last night as I lay on my pillow, last night as I lay on my bed, last night as I lay on my pillow, I dreamt that my body was dead. Bring back, bring back, oh bring back my body to me. To me, bring back, bring back, oh, bring back my body to me. The winds have blown over the ocean, the winds have blown over the sea, the winds have blown over the ocean and brought back my body to me. Everybody, bring back, bring back, oh, bring back my body to me, to me. Bring back, bring back, oh, bring back 
my body to me. I remember playtime at school. We used to tell each other or ask each other riddles. We tried to guess what they were. Oh gosh, what's that? Here's one. What has two hands but it doesn't clap? Hmm. What does two hands and it doesn't clap? Hmm. Two hands. Shall I tell you? What has two hands and doesn't clap? It's a clock. Two hands, but it doesn't clap. So I'll clap for you instead. Here's another one. Remember we did our head, shoulders, knees and toes? Well, we can, you can do that yourselves later. But this is another riddle. What has a neck? No head, a neck, but no head. Hmm. What has a neck, but no head? Shall I tell you? It's a bottle. It has a neck, but no head. This is a bottle of vinegar. I have it for my salad with oil. Nice. Nice to eat lots of salad and green things, isn't it? So there's your riddles, and I'm quite sure you have lots, 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 lots more, so you can have fun. There was always somebody at school who would say, What does your ma do? I say, My ma works all day long. What does she work at? She makes my dinner, she makes my bed, she does the washing, she welcomes me home, she irons the clothes. She does everything. She teaches me songs. Don't forget to say thank you. Thank you, Mom. Or thank you, Granny. Thank you means a lot when you say thank you. You don't just say, oh, that's mine. Thank you, you say. But then sometimes we pretend. We pretend. You know, you could say, well, my mother's a movie star or my mother is a trapeze artist. Well, mine wasn't. But then one day, when I was in Glasgow, I heard children singing this. Remember I told you I had a grass, Glasgow granny? Well, she knew this song. Here it is. You can have fun with it. My ma's a millionaire. Would you believe it? Blue eyes and curly hair. Walking down Buchanan Street. We her big banana feet. My ma's a millionaire. My ma's a millionaire, would you believe it? Blue eyes and curly hair, sitting among the Eskimos, playing a game of dominoes. My ma's a millionaire, sing it with me. My ma's a millionaire, would you believe it? Blue eyes and curly hair, walking down Buchanan Street. We are big banana feet, my ma's a millionaire. My ma's a millionaire, would you believe it? Blue eyes and curly hair, sitting among the Eskimos, playing a game of dominoes, my ma's a millionaire. Would you believe it? Well, I'll let you decide. Would you believe it? You can tell me later. Would you believe it? You could go marching around to that. I think we should sing our marching song because we can count in this as well. We get a lot of counting in school, but, but, we get a lot of fun as well. Especially if you can count and march and sing and play at the same time. So I think you know this one now. I don't need to teach you, because you know it. Are we ready? And you could have a leader. It might be you, or you. It might be you. I think it should be you. Are you ready to go marching? Marching. I'll march from here. Are we ready? And. 
The ants went marching one by one, hooray, hooray. The ants went marching one by one, hooray, hooray. The ants went marching one by one, and the little one stopped to suck his thumb. And they all went marching for to get out of the rain. The ants went marching two by two, hooray, hooray. The ants went marching two by two, hooray, hooray. The ants went marching two by two, and the little one stopped to tie his shoe. And they all went marching for to get out of the rain. The ants went marching three by three, hooray, hooray. The ants went marching three by three, hooray, hooray. The ants went marching three by three, and the little one stopped to climb a tree. And they all went marching for to get out of the rain. The ants went marching four by four, hooray, hooray. The ants went marching four by four, hooray, hooray. The ants went marching four by four, and the little one stopped to open the door. And they all went marching for to get out of the rain. The ants went marching five by five, hooray, hooray. The ants went marching five by five, hooray, hooray. The ants went marching five by five, and the little one stopped to take a dive. And they all went marching for to get out of the rain. The ants went marching six by six, hooray, hooray. The ants went marching six by six, hooray, hooray. The ants went marching six by six, and the little one stopped to pick up sticks. And they all went marching for to get out of the rain. The ants went marching seven by seven, hooray, hooray. The ants went marching seven by seven, hooray, hooray. The ants went marching seven by seven, and the little one stopped to look up to heaven. And they all went marching for to get out of the rain. The ants went marching eight by eight, hooray, hooray. The ants went marching eight by eight, hooray, hooray. The ants went marching eight by eight, but the little one stopped to shut the gate. And they all went marching for to get out of the rain. The ants went marching nine by nine, hooray, hooray. The ants went marching nine by nine, hooray, hooray. The ants went marching nine by nine, and the little one stopped and got out of line. And they all went marching for to get out of the rain. The ants went marching ten by ten, hooray, hooray. The ants went marching ten by ten, hooray, hooray. The ants went marching ten by ten, and the little one stopped and said, Do it again! And they all went marching for to get out of the rain. Wow, I wonder if they ever get tired. I do. Do you ever get tired? And maybe you said, well, I think I'll get my teddy and go to bed quite soon. I, I, I've got mine. I've got quite a few. I've got mine here. Should I sing you a song before we go to bed? Okay. How about this one then? It's about you, you know. Right. Are you ready for your little song? You can sing it with us. And if you have a teddy, sing this to your teddy. The bear went over the mountain, the bear went over the mountain, the bear went over the mountain to see what he could see, to see what he could see, to see what he could see. The bear went over the mountain, the bear went over the mountain, the bear went over the mountain to see what he could see. And what do you think he saw? And what do you think he saw? The other side of the mountain, the other side of the mountain, the other side of the mountain. And that was what he saw. And that was what he saw. And that was what he saw. The other side of the mountain, the other side of the mountain, the other side of the mountain.
the mountain, and that is what he saw. Did you like that? You did. Good. I take him to bed and snuggle. And when I go to school, I have to be very, very sure I go to bed in good time. When when I hear them, some a voice say, "Time to get ready for bed." I always catch my little bear and say, it's time for us to get ready for bed. And then I hear the other voice saying, and if you're not in bed before eight o'clock, Willy Winky will catch you. <gasps> Willy Winky will catch us. Well, we don't want that, do we? So here's the song. And remember, get ready for bed in good time. And you'll wake up bright and early, all happy and ready for school. That's a nice way to go to bed. And you can lie back in bed and hop one of your songs to yourself but first of all before we go we'll have our song we will the winky runs through the tomb upstairs and downstairs and is nicht gun rapping at the window crying through the locks are all the babies in their beds at past eight o'clock? Oh, have you got that? Let's sing it together. And actually, if you're with your mum or your granny or an auntie or just a friend, get them. make sure they're singing as well. Granny, are you singing? Oh, I'm glad. Oh, good. Grandpa's singing too. That's good. Okay, are we ready? All together. Right. We will be wing. He runs through the tune, upstairs and downstairs in his nicht gun, rapping at the window, crying through the locks, are all the babies in their beds, it past eight o'clock. And it's time for us to say bye-bye for today, and I hope that when you wake in the morning, you feel all bright and bright and ready to go to school and enjoy school. School is for learning lots of things. And the more songs you learn, and the more rhymes and the more poems, the better your memory will become. You ask an old person like me, where do you remember all that? Well, I learned it all when I went to school first. And what you learn when you're five, six, seven, eight, you remember forever. And I'm going to remember singing with you. So, bye-bye for now. I really enjoyed my time with you. And I'll put the words of these songs on Facebook. So, don't forget to sing them. Sing them when you go visiting. Sing them in this playground and sing them at home. Bye-bye. Thank you for being with me. Bye-bye. Did you enjoy that, Teddy?